Do women use men? Yes, of course they do. Of course they do. How do they use them? Why do they use them? We'll talk a little bit about this in this video. Okay, the truth is this is not just women that do this. Men use women, women use men, men use men, women use women. People use people. That's the truth of the matter. And the biggest rule about this is that people will use people who let them use them. If you let somebody use you, they will. So you have to have self-respect, you have to have confidence, and I'm gonna talk a little bit about this in this video, but I'm gonna talk first about why women use men. Okay, the biggest reason that I've seen, there's so many reasons why. I mean, there's financial reasons, maybe they want money, maybe they want um, you know protection, uh, maybe they want someone to help out take care of their child, maybe they want emotional support. Who knows, there's a big, big, big list of reasons. But what you have to look at in our society is that a lot of times we assume that men and women are the same or they're equal. And that's just, it's unfortunately not true. They're, they're, they're close and no one is better or worse than the other, but there are differences. Walking around in a dark parking lot at night is different for a woman than it is for a guy. Being at a job is different for a woman than it is for a guy. You have to take into account the experience that somebody has in order to understand why they would use somebody else. For example, I had a, uh, a client of mine who um, had a lot of female friends and uh, these female friends would invite him out. He would come hang out with them and they had such a good time with him and um, you know, it would usually be like maybe one or two that would hang out with him and they would invite him out and they would, he would go to them all the time to hang out and do whatever it is they wanted to do. Okay, none of these women were, were trying to sleep with him or date him for that matter. Okay, and obviously he started to develop feelings for them. Okay, so in his mind he was being used. And it sucks when you're in that position where women are doing this to you. Here's the thing though, what they were using him for was a very real thing. They like to go out and have fun and them walking on the sidewalk by themselves in maybe a dodgy neighborhood or something like that wasn't fun for them. Them hanging out in a bar by themselves made them feel like a little bit unsafe, especially in the areas that they, that they were hanging out. Just them having a guy there, it made them less likely to get hit on by a bunch of dudes that were creeping them out. It made them less likely for them to feel unsafe when they were walking to their cars or walking through a park or something like that late at night. So he provided the, the value of like a little bit of added security and sometimes they would talk about their boy troubles with other guys you know, with him as well too. In his mind, he was getting used because what he wanted was he wanted to date them and you know have some romantic connection with them, but they weren't down for that. So. Basically, what I had to tell him to do was to stand up for himself. If he didn't want to go hang out with them, he shouldn't. Now, what he wanted to say was he wanted to say, hey, well, you know what? You won't respect me, blah, blah, so I'm not coming. No, 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 no. He just said, no, I'm, I'm busy. I can't make it. I'm sorry. Okay? You don't need to cause any drama. You just stand up for yourself. Okay? Do the things that you want to do. And if they come to you, or maybe he invites them to come to him and do what he wants to do, that's more likely that a, re a relationship or some romantic connection can happen because he's, you know, he's on his own path and you know, he's being a little bit more masculine there. Okay? But if you are a guy and you're providing these things and you're going to them, a lot of times what's gonna happen is that you will be used and you will never ever get what you want. If what you want is to date them, which by the way, if you just want a friend and you just want someone to hang out with, it's totally fine too. I have tons of female friends. All right? Now, they are useful for me I enjoy our friendship because I'm not being used. Well, maybe they're using me, but I'm using them. <laughs> you know, They got friends I can hang out with. They're cool people to talk to. They do, they do the same things that I like to do. Like there's a lot of reasons to have women in your life. And you know, just having that kind of female energy is cool too. I, I, I enjoy that. But you have to understand if women are using you and not giving you what you want, you have to stand up for yourself and go for what it is you want because people will continually do it. And there's a lot of reasons why women use men. People think that we've advanced and we're so far you know into the future where everybody's the same and uh, that's just unfortunately not true like people um, you know it's, it's, it's still a different experience being a man and being a woman in our society and the fact of the matter is you are going to be used for certain things as a man and you have to be wary of those and if you're wary of them and you're and you know what's going on then it's more likely that you're gonna be able to resist them and stand up for what you want to do um, like my client eventually decided to do and then he eventually decided to start dating some women that he liked that respected him for what he wanted doesn't mean that these women were just like the worst kind of people. You know, they were doing what most people in their situation a lot of times will do is if they can have somebody to provide some value in their life, they're gonna keep doing it, okay? So don't get mad about it. Just, you know, go for what it is you want, stand up for yourself, and uh, you're gonna be a lot happier. Cool. All right, you guys, that's why women use men. I talk more about this in my training program, so if you want a link down below, you can sign up for my mailing list. That's where you can get access to my free masterclasses. Good luck out there, you guys. I'll talk soon.